Welcome back to Ask Dr. Clark. Today's topic, I'm divorcing my narcissist. What can I expect from the legal system? The short answer is nothing good or fair or just. I will go into more detail in my full answer. First, if you like my edgy, in-your-face, uh, not warm and fuzzy, biblically-based videos, then subscribe to my YouTube channel, which many of you are doing. Tap the like button and leave a rating and a review and a comment. And for all my resources on marital crisis, go to my website, davideclarkphd.com. That's Clark with an A, davideclarkphd.com. I've got a book for your marital crisis. I guarantee you I do. And you can talk to me about your situation in a 45-minute phone advice session. 95% of my practice now are phone advice sessions. Folks calling in from around the country, frankly, from around the world. And in 45 minutes, after taking your credit card information, I will give you a clear plan of action. And I'm now on TikTok. I'm a cutting-edge guy, as you can tell. So, uh, you can check out those uh, short form TikTok videos. Very short, very, very concise, and hopefully helpful. Okay, today's question. I read your Enough is Enough book and your 20 Lies book. Good, it's a good one two punch. I got strong enough to leave my abusive husband. Excellent. I have just filed divorce. What can I expect in the legal process? Yeah, good question. It's not going to be pretty. Here's my answer What you can expect is a brutal, knock down, drag out war with your narcissistic abuser. He will use the legal system to punish you for having the nerve to divorce him. The legal system is a joke. Uh, justice is not on the agenda. I guarantee you that. The court doesn't care that your spouse is abusive. You can't prove it legally probably. And even if you could, the court doesn't care. All the legal system cares about is all the professionals, especially the lawyers, getting paid. They don't care what happens to you. I've seen this over and over again. Even if you've got a great, solid, moral attorney, maybe even a Christian attorney, and tough, the, the system is still nasty and awful. The divorce process will take time. No one is in a hurry. I mean, no one. It will take money, a lot more money than you want to spend. And it will be painful. Being married to an abuser is awful. Divorcing one is also awful. Here's a brief summary of what will happen. Your abuser slash narcissist will hire a sleazeball attorney. They all do. He will lie about his income. He will make all kinds of legal motions through his sleazeball attorney to harass you and make you suffer. The court doesn't care about that. These are frivolous motions, whatever. He will be late getting records and information to the court and the court won't care. And he'll give you a hard time if you're a little late with something. If you have minor kids, he will fight for custody. He's not going to get full custody. He'll still fight for it to make you suffer. He'll claim you are an unfit mother. He'll get the guardian ad litem on his side. Avoid guardian ad litems if you can. If you can't, be very aware that he'll try to manipulate that person. He'll drag out the divorce to drain your emotional and financial resources. Absolutely. He'll agree to a deal and then he'll change his mind. He'll cancel hearings and mediation meetings at the last minute, and the court won't care. Okay, that's the bad news, and it's bad. But here's the good news. You will have God with you. You will get divorced from this dirt ball. You will be free to live a new life. It's going to be worth the awful process. His behavior will simply confirm that you're doing the right thing by divorcing him. Get a tough, experienced family law attorney and go to war, because that's what it is. No manby pamby panty waist lawyers. They lose every time. You want somebody tough, as tough as I am in, in the, as a psychologist. You want somebody mean and tough, not sleazeball, but who will get the job done for you. And please don't waste time and money and your sanity trying this collaborative divorce process. That's all the rage now. Let's do a collaborative divorce. Oh, it sounds so nice. What a joke. It doesn't work. With a decent person who you get going through a divorce with, this will work. You don't have a decent person. You've got a dirt ball. Don't waste your time and money on that. When has your abuser ever been collaborative about anything? Now, many will start off collaborative. Yeah, let's work together. He will then jerk the rug on you. You will have wasted your time and money. Will the attorneys refund the money you paid them for the collaborative divorce process? No, don't bother. One last thing, get my book, I didn't want a divorce. Now what? I wrote it for you. If you're going through a divorce or you've been divorced, this will help you heal, reset, get a new lease on life, understand how to treat your kids, how to manage your ex. It's all in here. 
it will help you.